Hi, it's Peggy with Creative Scraps, and this is um, for a close to my heart tutorial on um, a Marion Smith take on a photo box. And the challenge for Close to My Heart was to create um, this, uh, to create something with the Sophia um, workshop on the go. And oh my goodness, I just absolutely positively love that paper. It's just amazing, amazing paper. Close to My Heart has awesome paper. So what I did is I've been watching Marion Smith, and she has many different videos on how to create. Um, expandable photo boxes or little um, album boxes and so I watched her videos over and over and over because you know Marion Smith's just rocks and so I wanted to make a box with the Sophia line and all I had was white envelopes but it worked out fine because you know it's a lot of white in this pro pro product so let me get a closer let me show you here is the front which is this beautiful book polka dot paper and this floral paper and these little um this is a stamp set oh my gosh i cannot remember for the life of me at this moment what the stamp set is but i'll have it in the link below and um close to my heart um the sophia workshop on the go comes with um a totally different stamp set which i end up not using but I did use the buttons that came with the workshop on the go and the wa the waxy flax and um, I used the little pearl gems and it's just really cute and what I did is I did a th uh, kind of like a two 3D effect flower and a leaf and I rolled my edges and I did a two tone stamping and outline stamping so what do you do this is just going to be a real quick video but um, and on, let me show you the top three more flowers, some leaves, some gems. Just this paper is just so pretty. So it's going to make a cute little birthday photo box um for somebody. <laughs> Don't know who. So what I did is I poked two holes with the close my heart paper piercer in the chipboard through the paper and everything and then I I um uh ran waxy flax through the buttons and through the hole so the buttons are being held on by the waxy flax and then I added another little button just for so it would be easier to, to twirl it and I did the same thing with this button but I also also added a um, um, oh my gosh it just went right out of my head and I've been looking for them for an hour Velcro, Velcro closures. I'm sorry, I cannot believe. I need another cup of coffee. So, I, and I, so I stuck that on there just to give it a little bit more stability. And then what you do is you just take regular envelopes. These are envelopes that will fit four by six to six and a quarter um, cards, and also photos and stuff like that. So what I did is I followed her instructions. And if you want the instructions for this, go to Marion Smith or a piece of craft .com and go to her um, blog. You can also go to her YouTube, Marion Smith or Piece of Craft .com, um, YouTube account, and she has awesome tutorials. I cannot top her tutorial. It's just amazing. Um, and so then, and what I did is I took our Close to My Heart's one and a quarter punch, circle punch, and I made little tabs out of it. And then I used the background texture paper, and these are um, four and a quarter by six. No, four and a quarter by five and three fourths. So, um, and they fit right inside, um, right inside. I'm trying to do this one-handed in here, and I haven't put any pictures in it yet because I have to go through. I'm gonna actually pull some pictures out of my kids when they were littler, littler, littler. Is that a word? <laughs> I need a cup of coffee. Anyway, so here's my quick tutorial on. Um, the close to my heart's challenge was to make something with the with the Sophia um, workshop on the go. Love it. It's worth it. It's twenty nine ninety nine twenty nine ninety five, and you get tons of paper and a set of stamps and embellishments that coordinate. And it's just a really good um, deal. And I still have tons of product left over. Actually, I've already made two or three cards out of the out of the paper pack, 
and I'm actually probably going to make um, some more um, cards or tags to go inside this box. So um, thanks for watching. This is Peggy with Creative Scraps. Bye.